Hello guys, welcome to another 1.5 video and this is a one tick pulse limiter smallest and fastest I believe which is pistonless and all you need to have is the new redstone comparator and with the end dial on one block with redstone on and with it activated, doesn't matter how you activate it and one for the output doesn't work if you do it directly from that um, you have to have a redstone output to it so that's the smallest this piston here is only showing you it's a one tick pulse because pistons lose their block only on a one tick so it's definitely one tick the design I was using was on these which relies on a piston inside it to give out the one tick pulse so it's a non pistonless design which you could have wrapped around and you could have made a bit more compact like this but was it worth it? Well, left side is the piston design, right side is my one. These both go at the same time, and you'll see there is a tiny delay. This one is one tick slower to activate than this one. So, this one is a far faster one tick pulse, as in it activates sooner. There you are. This red block here is just showing you where the button would be, uh, where the button input would be anyway, so it's this block here. So everything after that is the actual circuit itself. And let's just activate at the same time. So this one is one tick shorter, so it also means that there is smaller delay or no delay in this redstone comparator, which is quite nice. So they are, that's basically a tutorial at the same time. So hope you've enjoyed that. Uh, it's quite a nice little simple thing, and uh, I'll see you next time.